Hey guys, what is up? My name is W567. I'm from the Minecraft list. And today, guys, we are continuing our Sims 4 on a budget. So if you haven't seen this series before, let me tell you a little bit about it. So what we have to do, we were given a budget of about, I think it was about 20,000. And um, we have to create a house based on the budget that we get as the starter. So we were given 20,000 to, uh, to transform the house into what it is right now. Uh, we only have 1,000 left. So um, we have to be quite sparing and careful of what we have. But we still have to build the bedrooms. And I don't know if we're going to have enough funds to do that for floor, wallpaper and furniture. So what we might have to do, I did notice last time when I was filming this, um, I did notice that um, the back part of the house is quite big compared to the front part of the house. So I was thinking if we can't decorate the house, always scale it down a bit. I think that's what we might do anyway, because it's quite big <laughs> for a house. So I think that's what we're going to start with today. We're going to start with... Um, I guess kind of scaling this down a little bit. Now, outwards is kind of a bit big. I think we should go back both ways one and in one. I think that would be enough. So I'm going to get rid of these walls. What do you mean the wall doesn't exist? It's right there. Right, get rid of the floor. We're going to try this again. Um, We're going to take out this back wall. There we go, all the money's coming in now. Right, and then we're going to delete one wall from the side here. Because we don't need this much space in the dining room anyway. And the only thing I was concerned about was the fact that we, that we don't need all of this space. I mean, we just don't. <laughs> I don't know why I thought we needed this much. Because we really just don't. I... I don't know what I was thinking. Honestly, I don't. Um, but we took one more of outside that side, which means we've got to take one out of this side. Now, I'm going to move all of the stuff we've already bought in here, uh, such as all of the toilet stuff. Because I don't really want to get rid of it. It's just going to cost us more anyway. So I'm just going to remove this wall down the side here. Just by one. Just get rid of all of these walls, I think. Oh, no, put that back, whatever that was. I don't know what I did, put that back. Oh, it was the thing from the other room. But yeah, I think we should get all of the upstairs rooms gone for now until we figure it out. Okay. All right, get rid of these four random light surges here. The door can stay for now because we are going to replace it. Uh, right. Let's get some walls in here. Now, we did do this last episode, but <laughs> we ran out of money. So I decided it'd probably be best if we just did what we had, I guess. So we're only going to go out two, I think, was this side. And then back in, was it? It is really uneven for me. <laughs> it is really uneven. Hang on, I'm going to put it back a bit. Where did it come from originally, the side wall? Okay, so it did become connected to that part, which means we've got to make it smaller. Um, oh, yeah, I didn't take the wall out from this side. That's why it looks odd. <laughs> that's why it looks odd. That's that's why. Uh, right, so we're going to go out two out this way, and we're going to come back in to here for now. Uh, wow, did not want to do that. Uh, right, so I guess move that and then grab i wanted the wall but the the wallpaper's fine too um i wanted to drag this back i missed the whole wall that's fine there you go it's automatically created a wall for us it's absolutely brilliant and then we're gonna go round here did i take out that wall Got three this side. Oh yeah, I forgot the room is uneven. <laughs> the house is uneven. I could make it even. That would make it even. 
Right, scratch that. We're making the house even. If I've got the chance, I'm going to have the chance to make the house even. <laughs> it's not going to be even on the plot but that's okay you know that is okay and it is allowed to be you know not perfect i mean we're gonna fix it anyway i think i think that's the way it's gonna go it's gonna be fixed why did i just put that back delete the wall delete said wall delete said floor this house is all sorts of, like, different shapes, I guess. But that's fine, you know. Why is it only done half of my wall? I don't appreciate that. I don't at all. Maybe I should remove these walls for a second. Get rid of the floors. Okay. Okay, I fixed it, guys. So basically what I did was i deleted the whole floor and re-put it in well just deleted one wall and put it back in so let's put our old walls back like that um and i know this is going to be off center but i need the wall here for the toddler's room because now the whole kind of place is uneven and then for the bathroom we are going to section this bit off I think this is a lot of a bit this is a much better setup we have 4,000 to spare half of the house is now finished we all we need now is some stairs well that's uh that's good it doesn't know what the stairs are come on I can't spell as well um well I need stairs please there we go okay uh fine we have to go the cheapest i think we have to go cheapest uh right so now to fit or not to fit that is the question uh apparently i have become wise during the sims uh this sims series i have become wise and it's now is it to be or not to be apparently apparently the fridge don't fit anymore <laughs> i mean something always has to go wrong when you're making a sims house right you're not making a sims house if something doesn't go wrong at one point or another oh it does fit all right it does fit in the corner all right then that's absolutely fine i wasn't worried were you worried now nah, i wasn't worried at all mm, fridge don't fit right that now is a lot better and since when did my cabinet get smaller what did i do what did, oh there's my cabinets outside when did i put it out there <laughs> i didn't remember putting it out there at all right and then the table will go here as per the norm well actually not as per the norm because i need to put it outside to make way for me stairs which i got rid of uh cannot spell um right upstairs we looking we looking okay we're looking okay <laughs> now where can i fit this thing hang on manger brain fog i forgot that i already made floors i am not doing i broke my floor i broke my floor <laughs> No, I broke my wall, not my floor. Uh, I tell you guys, my brain is gone today. I don't know what it is. There we go. I'm so clever. I'm really not, guys. Okay, so I've, I've taken the corner off of the wall. Now I can place my stairs in. And it will create, a hopefully, as it did before the thing for me the floor for me yes it created no it didn't why is there no floor hang on <laughs> this is the thing with sims oh again never mind it done it for me as soon as i put the wall back that's absolutely fine right put my wall back again <laughs> i put my wall back again 
why do you have to take out so much of my floor? I don't have a bathroom now. <sighs> Didn't think about that. Um, I'm going to have to turn the stairs around, aren't I? I'm trying to go back. <laughs> okay. Stairs are a no-no. We have to turn the stairs around. Since when could you do that? Oh, I just... Oh, okay. I thought I was buying a second one. Yeah. <laughs> that works. Right, now to find a home for this. See, now I don't have enough space. In my dining room. Now there's not enough space. Where before there was too much space. That will do. <laughs> We're going upstairs and we're going to put our wall back now. There you go. I'm solving all problems today. There you go. That's back. That wall's back. And that one. Yay! We fixed it. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm really excited. I'm really excited. I just solved issues. <laughs> okay. Calm. We have 4,000 left to spare. Let's do the rooms and then we'll focus on the outside. So I personally think I need to repaint this because it was already painted when I did it but uh first of all I need my lights I need my lights back um one oh uh two that should be enough it's not like they're gonna I hope that they're not gonna wreck the ceiling okay so this costs at least 30 a time And round here. And I think that's done. I think it's done. Yep, yeah, that's all done. That's good. Still 4,000. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Never been so happy in my life to celebrate a a wall being painted, but here we are. This is this is we're trying things new today. Uh right. Shower. Uh cheapest shower there is that isn't just on the wall. Uh Bathtub, cheapest that there is, but that just not a tub. That one will do. What is that? Luxury bath. Since when have they added that in there? Okay then. Um, we need a what are these called? Potty, practice potty. <laughs> sounds sounds lovely. And a toilet. You don't press R to rotate. I forgot. No, oh, look at that. That's so cute. I absolutely love it. Uh, now we need the sink. Um, and a mirror. Because if you weren't in the last episode, I'll explain why I'm putting a mirror in. Yes, it's probably completely useless to have a mirror in here. It actually helps the Sims and keeps them happy because if they are frustrated or upset for any reason or angry and they can't calm down, they will come to the bathroom and they will talk to themselves in the mirror. Yes, believe me, that is something that they do. So, we will add a mirror so if they get angry, they can talk to themselves. I mean, why wouldn't you want a mirror so you can talk to yourself? That's what I was asking. I talk to myself in the mirror all the time. But that's just me. Right. Baby room. We have a toddler. So toddlers now need to sleep in the cribs. So we're going to put a crib in. <laughs> Simple as that. <laughs> Adding a crib into the house. We are also going to... I don't think we need to add a high chair. She's already got one downstairs. Um, I guess... A this one of these maybe she likes grey so maybe in this <laughs> well she will like grey when she's older we hope <laughs> um I think we should definitely add a bookshelf children love bookshelves me being one of them loving bookshelves um right let's get one of these uh no we want something bigger than that don't we this one's nice. What can we get it in grey? That one's closer to what I'm looking for. Um, they also like playing with toys. So we're going to get some toys. We're going to have a speedy car. Uh, 
a teddy bear, Mr. Cuddles, a kitten, and a duck. I love that duck. Um, also, <laughs> we're going to get a lamp in here in case the mother needs it. Um, move that window over. Get a... Okay, we need to... I think we need to stop wasting it on loads of stuff for the kids' room. Let's focus on the parents' room. We can come back to this one later. And there's still a mirror in the parents' room. <laughs> right, parents' room. We're focusing on the parents' room now. Parents, I think just one big bed. Uh, the cheapest double bed that they've got. This one will be fine. And it's in the colours that they like. So that's fine. Um, and I think they definitely need a mirror. Uh, we need to save our expenses, I think. What else would they want in here? I guess the cheapest chest of... Maybe not the children one. This one will do. That costs a lot. Why do they cost so much? They're for children, though. They're going to have to go with this. Oh, that took out a lot money that hurt um right we're gonna need one light in here one light in here that'll be fine for the parents room i don't really know what else they're gonna need i guess some side tables cheapest nicest ones that we can get and um, maybe a clock actually they don't really need a clock um let's decorate the room now before we run out of expenses uh right wallpaper simple one the most simple one that they've got that looks good and matches with their themes so i think this one is fine in maybe what color is that i'm looking for kind of like a that one's fine Alright, colour that. Colour this. I did, I, okay, I've just remembered that you can actually put the walls up. Okay. Uh, for the hallway, I think something just nice and simple. Uh, for the kids' room, I think she'll like this one. Um, I think she will. It's nice, it's cheap. And uh, it looks pretty. So, that's fine. Uh, bathroom obviously in blue well that's just what I like anyway blue bathroom helps think of rain water I, I, I'm not a psychologist but uh, this put them back okay uh, and for the outside area maybe just a nice that's kind of a green. Just a nice bland colour for the outside. Maybe this grey. There you go. Okay, we're almost there. Now, final thing, doors. That's all we need. We just need some doors. The cheapest ones they have. Is an archway cheaper? I took a screenshot apparently. Uh, arch. They are not actually cheaper than your regular door. So we're going to pick the regular door. And we're going to put one here. One here. One here. That's all the doors done. Paint the outside of the house. Oh, we are cutting it close, guys. We are cutting it real close. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Is that it? The house looks fine. Oh, we've forgotten flooring in here. <laughs> huh. Why don't we have any flooring in here? Can you add flooring in here? How'd, oh, build floor. 
There we go. Okay. Okay. Whew. Okay. Um, it's going to be the same flooring as this. Just the traditional wood. Boom. Have we done it? I mean, seriously, have we done it? Uh, okay. Let's let's do the checklist, shall we? Living room, check. Dining room, check. Kitchen, check. I don't like that cabinet. Sorry. It's fine now. It's fine. I don't like that cabinet. Um, right, dining room, check. Upstairs. We, I don't have a floor upstairs. I forgot the flooring. Uh, we were also missing one tile here. That's fine. <laughs> flooring, let's do that. Upstairs, gonna be the same thing. It's downstairs, I think. It's gonna be traditional wood. Uh, right, traditional wood. Okay. Why would I want tan bark? Um, for, do they have any carpets? Kids room, boom. <laughs> we are cutting it way too close here, guys. Uh, I think we can go with the traditional wood for the bathroom. Oh my gosh. I don't like this. Oh, we're running so low. I hope we have enough of this. And then for the bedroom, maybe just this. Insufficient funds. Okay. No problem. Can I back out? And, okay, slight problem. What about this one? Why can't I place a floor down? Do I really not have enough funds? Costs 168 for this. Can I have this in white? 168 for that. Seriously? The bedroom is so... Whoa. Okay, so the kid might not have any flooring. But that's fine. When we get more money, we'll give her a little bit of flooring and we'll say it's for... Actually, we don't need to do that. We can sell some of the toys. It's absolutely fine. She doesn't need that many toys anyway. Um... <laughs> Right, we're gonna go. Why won't it let me scroll? Let me scroll. I wish to see all. Uh, I wish to see all the floorings, please. Child floorings, please. I saw it just a second ago. Oh, what's that one? <laughs> Here, four. Sixty. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go. I'm so happy with that. Oh, <sighs> we have the flooring done. We have everything done. We have 74. I'm sure we could have added something in here, but I think, in all fairness, it's not that important right now. Um, they've got entertainment. <laughs> they've got a kitchen. They've got a dining room. They have a bathroom, a bedroom, and a child's room. We've done it, guys. I can't believe it. I'm so happy with that. Okay. I'm so happy with that. I can't believe it. We did it. <laughs> I mean, let's just take a look outside for a minute. How do I put the floors up? Look out here for a minute. I mean, this is just incredible. Hang I want to put this down. How do you put this down? I don't think I can. Never mind. Look at this. Oh, we don't have any windows. It's fine. We don't need windows. You're only going to see it from the front anyway. There you go, guys. I can't believe we have finished the house fully and we were left with 74 simoleons. Now that is how you create a house on a budget. I am so happy with the results. I don't know about you guys. I am so I am so happy with it. I I can't even begin to explain how happy that I am that we finished it. 
I mean, it's great. Honestly, it is. And it's like a dream come true. I don't think we need the windows on the sides, though. I think we can move them around here. Just because I think we need more windows around the side. And the, the, the parents have got plenty of them. There you go. That actually looks a lot better. And why have we got one window on the side? It's fine. There you go. I think it looks really, really cute. And I cannot wait for our Sims to live in here. But I think, guys, I'm going to end it here today. And we're going to start playing with these guys next episode. So if you are enjoying this series, please leave a thumbs up. That would be entirely appreciated. And if this is the first video seen by me, please consider subscribing to join my team. I'd really appreciate it. We do fun stuff like this all the time um, where we basically go on a game and just have some fun and it really is worth it guys and i love these series if you like it too let me know if there's anything you think i should uh, do or anything i can add to the house with 74 simoleons please let me know um and i think that's pretty much all i need to say but thank you so much for watching and uh, i will see you in the next one bye